Hubba 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 on RuneScape 3! Today will be my very first RuneScape 3 ball sack video! Yes! Don't you worry about clapping and applauding, it is sexy and awesome. Today we'll be battling fucking assholes. And as you basically pretty much see, I have once again my fucking custom setting. Once again, if you choose to make a custom setting, all you really have to do is just save your setting. You go into setting, and then you can customize your setting, and then you can load it whenever you want to. It actually comes in pretty good handy. <laughs> so, you know, Jagex may not make a lot of fucking awesome updates, but having them save your layout, that's actually a good one. The only problem is that I never get to see what my friends fucking say, because the, the goddamn the chat for the friends don't appear on the screen. Although I could put put this shit down and, you know, fucking, where's the guy in French chat and see what this one is. Nightmare RH logged off at EOC right now. I'm not, motherfucker, I don't have you added. How do you know if I'm on RuneScape or not, jackass? Alright, anyways, let's fucking begin the ball sack fucking adventure. Dig with the little spades of hell here. I don't know where the fuck these spades came from. Oh, today has been a crazy ass fucking day for some reason. I really don't know why, but today has just kind of really felt like, uh, well, it's it just really ah uh, no no Durok in the tunnel the tunnel of the Durok the tunnel of the doom no god damn motherfuckers uh, up 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 and then we have uh, Varok the defiled and shit you know I don't even think I may waste an ah fuck it I might as well use a goddamn overload and shit uh, more than likely Barrows has yeah this is a fucking joke. <laughs> I should really do Barrows more fucking often. I, uh, this is just, uh, this is just crap. I don't even think you need any food at fucking the Barrows Brothers. I don't even think we have to pray at the Barrows Brothers. We don't even need fucking piety at the goddamn Barrows Brothers. Who the fuck is this? Goddamn assassins and shit. Anyways, probably most likely going to be doing a lot more live streaming next week, considering the fact that fucking, uh, I just kind of really want to and shit. Probably going to do Nazi Zombie fucking live stream, mainly because I love playing Nazi Zombies, and uh, probably just going to do that. I set up my HTB, uh, HD beef, uh, PVR, the little camera, little doodad device and shit, and it was actually, yeah, well, it's actually high definition in a nutshell. The only bad fucking thing about my HD PVR is that when I turn it on, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Ah, oh, what the hell is this? Ah, oh, shit, how the fuck did we get turned around? Ah, oh, god damn it. Naughty, naughty sons of bitches. You always gotta remember that it looks like a smiley face. You see, you have the nose, the two eyes, then a fucking smiley face here. What the fuck? I don't know how we got turned around there. Whatever fucking way is, is really annoying. Yeah, King Black Dragon has more HP than this motherfucker over here. Not to mention, he's not even attacking. He's, he's not even doing shit. Barrows is so easy! Ooh, I'm gonna fucking use destroy on him. And it's gone! <laughs> ah, the Barrows brothers have been fucking defeated. Why does this camera get turned the fuck around every goddamn motherfucking time? Gets really annoying, my friends. Anyways, today, one thing I actually did buy was um, a Supernatural season. I actually haven't watched a so show uh, Supernatural in a long ass time. And I was actually in the video store, and they ha they were having a sale, especially in the um, DVD section. And the thing was uh, on sale from, like, $50 to, like, fucking $25. It was, like, 50% off. I'm like, oh, holy shit! 50% off? We must buy! And then I came home and realized that the season was on fucking Netflix and wanted to punch myself in the balls. Yeah! You know your life sucks! When you spend $25 on something that is free on the internet that you're paying a monthly fucking fee to watch Netflix for. Yeah, it's basically kind of, kind of you know, it's, it's a kick in the scrotum. Not everyone is as fortunate as me that really wants to kick themselves in the balls, but Jesus Christ. Dragor weapons, you are so sexy. I really have to buy Dragor uh, fucking malls and shit. Who the fuck is this asshole? True Assassin. Get off my wiener. You're stepping on my wiener and I don't like it. If you buy fucking goddamn, um, the, uh, the maces, because the thing about the fucking maces is that, oh, we gotta fucking eat some food here. Fucking Mr. Durak is gonna come out of nowhere and try to kick my balls. 
if you fucking use the maces and shit, you can actually, um, it has like an auto retaliate hit for the fastest. It's a lot faster than the goddamn, uh, longsword and fucking, uh, longsword. Oh shit, I just realized something. We don't have a fucking teleportation device. <laughs> ah, shit. Oh, fuck. Well, this is going to be a very fucking interesting uh, video then. Oh, shit. I always fucking forget goddamn teleporting devices. God damn it. How do I forget this shit? I don't understand. Oh, and there it is. The, the cock knocker of fucking wielding cocks. Shit. Turn on. Protect from uh, melee. Protect from melee. Oh, fuck. Holy shit. Turn it on. There we go. Oh, my God. If we would have died, that would have been... Oh, my God. That would have been a really bad fucking time. Really extremely fucking bad time. And, oh, my God. We're actually fucking dying. Holy shit. Wouldn't... Don't really see the day that fucking Nightmare H dies to Durak and shit. All right. But anyways, yeah. So, um... Otherwise, it's always interesting when we don't have a fucking teleport. Just like on live stream, I accidentally fucking forgot a goddamn teleportation. Almost fucking died, which kind of fucking really sucked balls. But uh, for the most part, <laughs> ah, we really should. Yes, we are alive. Okay, fucking square. Open sesame. Fuck you. Square. Open sesame. Where is it? Square. Open sesame. Yes, we have made it into the cock factory. Wow. They haven't really changed this fucking shit drastically. Um, now, if you kill more fucking little minions and shit, it doesn't really, it, it doesn't bring up the chance of the fucking items and stuff. It just increases the chance of the runes. That's what a lot of people fucking get mistaken for and, and shit. But today, we're going to open the chest, and we're going to pray for something sexy and awesome. And we're going to fucking loot the chest. And we got shit. Better yet, we got absolute shit. Where's the goddamn mage book? Please be able to home teleport. Home teleport. Oh my god, it works! <laughs> teleport to Cathabay. I actually just recently unlocked fucking um, a canvas uh, goddamn teleportation and shit. I never knew there was a lodestone in fucking canvas. That's fucking awesome! Alright guys, but today has been the easiest ball sack fucking run of my entire RuneScape life. I don't really think I had an easier ball sack run fucking ever. Even before Evolution of Cox came out, ball sack was still a little hard. <laughs> Now, ball sack is like, well, it's kind of like old man balls. It sags down all the way to your fucking knees, and, well, it just becomes really, really, really easy to do. Anyways, not to mention drag or weapons fucking own. Woohoo! Ah, if you motherfuckers enjoy this video or are having a sexy, sexy weekend or about to have a sexy weekend, then you can let me know in some nasty, dirty little comments. Otherwise, last night, I fucking asked you guys to leave some nasty, dirty little comments. Some of you guys replied, some of you guys didn't. Basically asking, what is the dirtiest thing you ever did with a fucking banana? Yeah! So basically, as you see on the screen right now, are some fucking responses to the question that I pretty much asked. I'm going to leave you guys with a question tonight of interesting crap. What is the most interesting thing you have ever done with a fucking iPhone? Yes! A friend of mine is an EMT and, um in fucking uh, Miami, Florida. And when the iPhone 5 came out, he was actually in the ER. Literally, the first fucking day the iPhone 5 came out, they had someone come in the ER because the, the, the fucking iPhone 5 was shoved up the guy... It was lodged in the guy's colon. Which means the guy shoved it up his ass and couldn't get it out. <laughs> ah, that is a little story. But the most interesting shit I have ever done with a fucking iPhone is actually, well... I actually used it to fucking swipe my credit card. That was actually the most interesting fucking shit I've ever done with my iPhone. I downloaded an application and used it to swipe and pay for something online. It was pretty fucking awesome. I could actually just swipe my own credit card. Otherwise, let me know some nasty dirty little comments about that. I'll see you motherfuckers in a few. Bye!